Football DRFC, your Dogs Rovers fan channel. It's preview day. It's a preview. Uh, the international football is here. The Euros are right around the corner. The Olympics are only a month or so away. And England start their international friendlies. Two international friendlies. Uh, we have one with Austria, which is coming up tomorrow, and one with Romania, which is happening a few days afterwards. Uh, we're going to share with you my predicted lineup with my preferred formation. I think he's going to go with the 4 3 3. I think that's how we're going to set up in this game. Obviously, England playing this game uh, against Austria. Austria do have some good players, not going to lie. Uh, but it should be an interesting game. Now, of course, there is selection headaches for Southgate going into to, uh, the well, go at well. It was going into um, into yesterday's squad announcement. Uh, well, sorry, not yesterday. Today, why don't we get my days mixed up? Uh, today with the squad announcement. Obviously, it's it, it's nice to see uh, some players in there. Um, it's great to see a nice squad. I think it's a decent squad that they've announced. So it should be interesting uh, to see who plays more games than others in the Euros. But we focus on the friendly in this one, and of course, it is against Austria. So. Uh, we have to go through the team lineup, and I'm going to share why I think this. So, of course, you can see some numerous players missing uh, from this. Uh, the likes of Sterling's not in there. Uh, Chilwell's not in there. Walker's not in there. Um, it's very much not Chelsea Man City based. And the reason for that is, for, of course, the reason of the Champions League final. Uh, congratulations, Chelsea, by the way. There was a lot of celebrations. And Egal, shout out to Egal, the Arsenal fan. He's painted himself like an avatar. <laughs> shout out, Egal. He's, he's up for the bands. Uh, but let's have a look through my predicted team. Uh, so we've got Jordan Pickford in goal. He, they, they might go with uh, Henderson, obviously Pope's injured, so it's going to have to be Ramsdale probably uh, as the third choice. But I think they're probably going to go with Pickford in this one if he's if he's recovered. Um, back four of Shaw, Mings, Cody and Trippier. I, I expect that to be the back four in my opinion. Um, Shaw obviously where Chilwell would be. Uh, Stones is in the squad. Obviously, Maguire's not 100% yet, and they want to save him for the Euro, so it'll be Mings and Cody in the back line. Trippier at right back. I've got no surprises there. Rice and Bellingham in the midfield behind Grealish. I think Grealish is the cam in the 4 3 3 works well. I think Rice is the defensive midfielder. Bellingham is the box to box playmaker, uh, making the forward and backward runs in front of and behind Grealish. Rice staying back, doing the assurity, doing the defensive work. Uh, on the wings, Rashford on the left, Sancho on the right, potentially United teammates next season, and of course up front is Harry Class A, you know the rest, shout out to Expressions for that one, uh, but yeah 4-3-3 Perfect team, in my opinion. Uh, there's no reason why we can't get the win. So my prediction in terms of scoreline will be a 3-0 win. I think we'll get the goals. I think we'll put Austria out of their misery in this game. I'm not saying that Austria have a very bad squad. I'm not saying that at all. I think Austria can provide something because we are... Sometimes we can put ourselves in situations where we don't usually like to put ourselves in the best situations sometimes. Um, and plus, even if John Stones was 100% going into the game tomorrow, I wouldn't even start him because he made four mistakes in the Champions League final and Sterling took too many touches on a few occasions in the Champions League final. So I wouldn't have even started Sterling and Stones even if they were available and didn't play in the Champions League final or they were available anyway, you know, I wouldn't have started them because they made too many mistakes in the Champions League final to want to start them in this game. And of course, it is a friendly. So Sterling and Stones, if they start complaining, you know, they're going to have a, f a full Euros to show themselves what they can do. So, you know, I think this is the time for other players like your Cody's, your Mings, um... You know, Sancho starting, you know, Bellingham starting, Grealish having a start. This is their time to show what they can do. Uh, so there we go, guys. Thank you very, very much for this short preview. Make sure you stay tuned for the review after the match. And for now, guys, I might, I might do a watch long. I might do a watch long. Stay tuned if, if there is going to be a watch long. Uh, but for now, guys, I'm Aaron Chandler from Forever Football, DRSC, Caitlin and the Rover's Life, and that, my friends, full time. Rover's Side Die. Come on, Three Lions. Three Lions on the shirt. Rover's Side Die! I'm over!